How you doing folks? And this is my video of my 1980 The reason I'm doing this video is because I want this car to get to the right person. Talk about a, uh, a classic and you don't see this very often. This car was purchased brand new from O'Reilly Chevrolet on Broadway here in Tucson. And it is a one owner. See that? O'Reilly Chevrolet, there's the original license plate. This is a one owner vehicle. And this will kind of give you an idea of who the owner was. It was a lady, a very nice lady. Treat others as you want to be treated. This car is a classic. serviced by mechanics and this lady bought it brand new at O'Reilly and she recently decided she shouldn't be driving she's elderly enough that she should not be driving so she put her car up for sale this car is unbelievable it's never been in a wreck except for this a small bit of damage that was done here and because of that it was touched up but other than that no major accidents anywhere never no hot rotting I mean wait till you see there's a factory this is the factory paint it's not perfect take a look in here look at this car So this is a clean looking car. Anyway, I acquired this car. It so far has uh, a clear title, open title. And so basically it has one person's name on this car. Ever. Anybody wants a classic Camaro, this is it right here. And the main thing I'm trying to do here is I want to get the owner. So I can appreciate and respect this car the way it should be. Because you're not going to find very often, very often you're going to find a one owner car like this. They've been wrecked, they rust, stayed here in Arizona. There's the major, the worst damage in the whole car right here. Is that, that's it, that little piece of the seat. Because she did drive this car for, for a long time. She uh, drove it very little. Now she ended up having to drive on the freeway constantly. Every day she drove on the freeway. So she put a bunch of miles on it. Does it look like it has a bunch of miles? No. So the car... Wait till I'm going to show you how it starts and runs. There's your odometer, which only doesn't go past 100,000 miles, so it does, it's already rolled over. Anyway, no cracks in the windshield. Um, I'm telling you, this is a classic car. Beautiful. Windows door, the back hatch has the automatic uh, pull down. I went ahead and rebuilt that because, like usual, they they need something. They need a rebuild. Uh, you know the dash has a few cracks, but it's got a dash cover on it. Looks great. Okay, let's show you the back hatch. It's the auto pull down. I mean, look at this car. This car is classic. Here we go. Put brand new uh, shock struts on the back. These are just floor mats here. I think it's clean. Very clean. Okay. I'll 
show you the way the, wa the hatch works. Pull it down. Goes all the way down. Ching, ching. There we go. So, what an awesome car. Okay, let me start it up. I'm going to show you how she runs. Like I said, it is the V6, but this thing is unbelievable. Yeah, I got to open the hood here. Because this thing, you got to see under the hood. I was amazed. I haven't cleaned it a little bit. But I should. But, because uh, I'm telling you, look at this thing. It was kept in the garage its entire life. This was a garaged car. Okay, so here's the hood. Take a look. Oh my. Definitely should uh, steam clean the heck out of it, but I'm telling you, this thing is quite amazing. The condition it's in and the, and the way you literally eat off this thing as far as the motor goes. That's quite amazing. The condition is kept in a garage its entire life. And I opened up the uh, air cleaner. But bro, of course, it had a brand new, brand new. Uh, New belts, new brakes, new uh, new struts. Literally, yeah, just put the struts in here. At least that brand new filters. Okay, hang on. I gotta close this up because I'm gonna drive it for you. Okay, pretty neat. These little hair cleaner assembly. A little different. Down. I haven't seen many cars that have something like this an air cleaner system or that still has it I should say okay let's go for a drive in this car yeah I'm telling you this thing is sweet it's just so nice I look at it going wow okay When I first picked it up, it seemed like it barely ran. Just it needed a carb cleaner. Literally. That was the only thing I had to do to it. Throw some carb cleaner in there. Suspension feels like you're driving a fairly new car. I mean, I'm telling you, man, this thing is tight. Suspension is tight. I get on the freeway and love the freeway. So anyway, here we are in my 88 Camaro. She think, this thing is sweet. All right, folks. Anyone want to buy it? Let me know. This is in Tucson, Arizona. Oops, that's the uh, scraper on the bottom. So here we are. You saw in Arizona, 88 car, go ahead. This is the stop sign. You don't have a stop sign. Go ahead, here. Go ahead, go ahead. Got caps. And here we go. Six 
cylinder. Stock as can be. How's that? That's Johnny, this thing is just sweet. Alright. Well, folks, have a great day. Thanks for checking out my 88 Camaro.